Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Tracy Beth Hogue, Senior Advisor for Clinical Sciences at the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. It is estimated that over 10% of American women of childbearing age are taking SSRIs, and about half of them will go on to continue their use during pregnancy. It is, however, unclear if these women and the public are being fully informed about the limitations in what we know about their efficacy in pregnancy or the known and potential adverse impacts on the mother and child. SSRI medications impact the way our body uses serotonin, and serotonin plays a crucial role in fetal development, particularly of the brain and heart. Risks to the developing baby already acknowledged on at least one FDA label include cardiac birth defects, blood pressure elevation, and drug discontinuation syndrome in the newborn. The FDA also acknowledges that mothers who use SSRIs while pregnant are at higher risk of postpartum bleeding. Additional studies not mentioned on an FDA label indicate SSRI use during pregnancy is correlated with higher rates of miscarriage, preterm birth, and negative impacts on neurocognitive development in the child. Furthermore, we don't have randomized or gold standard evidence of either the safety or efficacy of SSRIs in pregnancy. Here at the FDA, we are committed to informing the public being transparent, and considering emerging and potentially overlooked scientific evidence. This Monday, July 21st at 10 a.m., we will be hosting a roundtable convening many of the world's leading experts with diverse points of view on the topic of SSRI use in pregnancy. We hope you will be able to join us on the live stream this Monday for what is certain to be a fascinating and informative discussion.